Hello. Learning how to do ultrasound guided core biopsies is, is a really useful technique in obtaining tissue for histology and also for culture if you wish to make a diagnosis on someone presenting uh, with a mass, uh, perhaps a, a lymph node swelling in the neck or a breast lump. Uh, this technique can also be used to undertake uh, liver biopsy and kidney biopsy and biopsying of uh, solid organs and solid masses. Uh, some people undertake uh, fine needle aspirates or FNAs, but in my experience the yield from these is uh, poor in terms of making uh, a proper tissue diagnosis. Using the ultrasound machine uh, for guiding the needle into the uh, area that you want to biopsy uh, improves both safety and also the yield in obtaining material from exactly the right area that you wish to sample. We're going to show you how to use a 16 gauge Temno needle uh, to biopsy a lump. Um, don't forget that when you get your material from the little channel in the biopsy needle that you'll need to send it informal in for histology and if relevant don't forget to send a little sample in sterile normal saline for culture. A safe way of learning their technique we're going to show you here with some students from the American University of the Caribbean School of Medicine and we've uh, bought a couple of whole chickens and uh, inserted some olives into the flesh of the chicken underwater so there's no chance of allowing air to get into the tissue and this is uh, a really good substitute uh, for a real life patient um, and in this way you can practice the technique of uh, the ultrasound and uh, approaching the lump that you wish to biopsy with the needle in a very safe and accurate way. The Temno biopsy needle is loaded by pulling back on the trigger. There are two positions depending on what size of biopsy you wish to take. When you insert the needle into the tissue you want this tip of the needle to be right up against the tissue that you wish to biopsy and then advance by pushing on the trigger the center portion of the needle into the tissue which will prolapse into that groove there you can see. The very last few millimeters of movement on the trigger will then close the outer portion uh, of the needle and shave off the tissue that's by prolapsed into the groove. To do the biopsy you'll be using a high frequency linear probe uh, to, to give you ultrasound guidance. And the key here is the lining up of the needle with the axis of the probe. So if this is on the skin, you want to put the tip of the needle exactly halfway between one side of the probe and the other. And make sure that it's lined up with the axis and exactly parallel with the axis of the ultrasound probe. Pass the needle down and you should be able to watch it the whole way from tip to where it comes under the probe, just under the skin. Uh, if you move the probe or the needle slightly to one side or the other you won't see the needle in its entire track at all and also if you angle the needle slightly off from what's precisely parallel with the probe you'll only see a short segment of the needle and the biopsy procedure won't be as accurate or safe as what you want it to be. Okay. Try just Push that, yeah, okay. And push it and just see it. Make it click. Wonderful. Still, but this thing is slippery. Yep. 
This is exactly what happens with a human being, is you have to push really hard and it distorts the tissues as you do it. Oh, there we are. There you go. Sure, there they are. Alright. I'm going to push in now. Oh, no. Get, get it in the picture. Get it in the picture. You see, it just came into the picture then. So try and get it in the picture. There, that's it. That's a good fella. Okay. Okay. That's beautiful, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Alright, oh, punch, right, punch coming out. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's see what we got. I like that. <laughs> Do we have an olive? Congratulations, okay. sir. Is it green? Yeah, a little bit green. Yeah, yeah. I can't see. Where am I going? Right see. there. Well done. Thank you. Well done. There's an olive. There, so it's to the left. So you could come back a bit and aim to the left. That'll be confusing, so I'm hearing stuff, but then I was like, I'm all over the Yes. <coughs> there you go. There is the olive yes. with the garlic in the middle amongst or in amongst the flesh of the chicken breast. Oh, it's the trolley that moves. Okay, never mind. I don't no, know. is it on foot? Is it there? You see that needle? Mm. No. Is it there? Oh, there. 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 You can see it. I just yeah, need all right. It. See if you can line up the whole length of the needle. Oh, you're in. I'm in it. You're already, in it. Okay, fantastic. Yeah. Oh yeah. This is it's too easy for you guys. Fire it off. Then. Good <laughs> <Good one. laughs> oh. Oh, you guys fire it off then. Oh, 